What's good YouTube is Vex Reacts and I'm back with another reaction video. The reason that I took a while to react to this specific song is because I wanted to go watch the movie in theaters before I spoiled the song. So now we can finally jump into it because I did see the movie. I'm not going to spoil anything, but it was amazing. It honestly motivated me, you know, to go out there. And even if you struggled in your past or you didn't do the best in your past, you could create a new timeline by the choices that you make right now. If you watch the movie, you know what I'm talking about. But let's get into the video and see what we got. They picked the perfect song to put into this movie too. It's definitely giving superhero. Slash, spark. back. mark. tap. Put it to Bro, this beat is just so sinister. Nah, we need to hear that all over again, bro. The vocals on this part was beautiful. The rapping, the the suspense that they gave us right here. Bro, it literally felt like I was listening to a movie. And I love the little like wordplay where it's like red all over my body, Deadpool references. Come on, bro. Slash, Wolverine, and Deadpool. Here you go.
nah. Bro, this whole situation with them and Deadpool and Wolverine, even down to like them interacting in interviews and things like that, I love this, bro. I feel like 2024 is already legendary just for the fact that they got this collab, bro. Not to mention that this legendary mini album that they just dropped, bro. This is top tier. I will be getting the unboxing video out soon. I'm sorry, y'all. I had to take a little break from content and stuff like that. And I know some of y'all will be like, oh, like, you don't got to apologize. But, bro, I really have missed making videos, enjoying the guys, which I've seen a couple of videos here and there. You know what I'm saying? Um, On my own, just because I'm, it's just part of my day. But I didn't have time to sit there and react and stuff like that because um, I've been going traveling and working super, super hard. I've been exhausted. You know what I'm saying? I feel like I've been overworking myself in the past between work and you know my and doing youtube and stuff like that but i had to game plan and figure out a situation that's gonna work for me and i went to, to the movie theater to escape i felt like i haven't done like something like that for me in a while i know i want to go get a massage soon or something like that but um now i feel like i'm back and i gotta focus a little bit more when it is time to actually do stuff because i think procrastination and things like that also played a part in me getting really really exhausted because i wouldn't want to you know not work but also procrastinating and wasted time when I didn't need to. So I'm just growing, improving, just turned 24. I feel like 24 got to be a good, you know, you know what I'm saying? A good year, you know, RIP Kobe, but 24 got to be my year. And I'm willing to do what I got to do to make that happen or to make that happen, job or not. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm pe I'm at peace in my life. You know what I'm saying? I don't have hella, hella responsibilities. My only responsibility is to grow my YouTube channel, to be healthy, to be happy. And you know what I'm saying? Keep a roof over my head. And I feel like if I do that and I learn how to establish what I want to establish in my life everything will be all right you know what I'm saying I feel like we all got the same fate and I don't need to stress myself doing too too much but uh, I ain't gonna get too too sad on y'all you know what I'm saying I just appreciate y'all because I'm 24 now and y'all gonna get to see me from 24 to 25 so I hope you guys enjoyed the, the journey and I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know in the comment section below did y'all actually go check out the Deadpool, Deadpool and Wolverine movie and did you enjoy it I felt like it was really really fun really really cool and it was they did a great job at not messing up the timeline but still you know making everything make sense and it was really really cool I enjoyed it a lot and Ryan Reynolds did an amazing job his humor is just 10 out of 10 he the perfect person for for that character and i enjoyed the entire movie it's exactly what you expect out of a deadpool movie um and they kept wolverine steel you know what i'm saying hugh jackman did an amazing job at you know keeping that uh that pressure on during the vid during the movie like he felt like wolverine bro like he really is a legend i think i made a tweet about this but i think it's the coolest thing ever that when we think of superheroes you know regardless of who it is um we think of a human an actor who is associated with that for deadpool we think of ryan reynolds for wolverine we think of hugh jackman we associate that with a person and that person gets to be in some in, in millions and millions of people's mind a superhero you know what i'm saying so i think it's really really cool that they get the opportunity to do that and live that dream out you know what i'm saying growing up i used to love you know superheroes and i never believed that i could be a superhero in the terms of you know what i'm saying the way that they can be it you know what i'm saying but they really get to be superheroes so i think it's really really cool y'all let me know how y'all felt about the movie and you know make sure you hit the like button and subscribe because it do help out thank you guys for watching to this point in the video i appreciate you who did you enjoy more in the movie deadpool or wolverine i enjoyed deadpool a lot more but you know it was a deadpool movie and i feel like wolverine and deadpool go so well together deadpool definitely brought out some emotional moments and i think that's what's the cool thing about deadpool is he could bring out those emotional moments even though uh even though he is you know a funny character a, a joking character and wolverine you know what i'm saying he always go do his thing but i'll catch y'all in the next video